of the Bruins. I, I want to have the tattoo because um, some people have a passion, whatever their passion is, and in some way or another, they express it. And uh, this is how I'm going to do it. Well, I've done the Stanley Cup. I've done a. Uh, I've done tattoos of the, the great Bobby Orr with the, you know, the, the trademark jump he did. As the finals were, were going into game seven, what were you thinking? <laughs> thinking if they win this, I'm going to be a busy boy. <laughs> I'm all set for you. Yeah. I've always been a little leery of it. I, I had butterflies coming in here, but I'm kind of over it now. I, I, when I set my mind to doing it, I said I'm going to do it. And, yeah. All righty. You ready to go? Yep. You ready? Yep. The Bruins are basically a passion for me. That's a line. I, I play amateur hockey, and my two boys play hockey. It's <laughs> not the worst. No, 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 it ain't too bad. It's, it's not as bad as I thought. Let's put it that way. How's that? Do you remember the last time they won the cup? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I remember it very well. You know, well, it was the Rangers, but I remember the brew of the Bobby All one better because that was the goal, and I was sitting there with my father, and uh, I was probably about 10 or 11, and um, right, right after that, my parents bought me the Bobby Orr Rally Skates, and that was it. You know, that was the end of it. And my boys, everything, even I got a 21-year-old who used to try to threaten me uh, with, uh, uh, Dad, I'm gonna be a Canadians fan instead of a Bruins fan. I said, if you want to be a Canadians fan, it's all right. I can't stop you, but you know, you want to go for the losers, that's what you can go for, it, you know. My whole family watched it with me, and uh, I sit two feet from the TV this close, and it was like, never left the TV, and I still don't believe it happened, but you know it did. <laughs> My wife is getting nervous now because like, I never had a bike and now she's I get, I get a Holly for eight months ago and now I get my first tattoo. Midlife crisis? Yeah. <laughs> uh, I love that I finally get the chance to, to put it there. I never thought I would have the chance. And my neighbor yelled out to me, he's a 22-year neighbor, get along great, and he said, Neil, are you finally going to be happy now? And I yelled back at him and I said, yes. I'm going to be happy now. <laughs> it is going to bleed and ooze, so you're probably going to want to keep a paper towel handy to blot it. Okay. Um, the bleeding will slow down. It will okay. be oozing a little bit tomorrow. You may notice a little bit of swelling, too.